today we're going to upgrade our Steam Deck with a terabyte NVMe. Um, I purchased this one so we could take a look at it and um, upgrade to Windows 2 also. But today we're just going to replace the actual NVMe. So let's go ahead and replace it. So first of all, get a cloth. Make sure you have enough um, torque on your system to actually work on it. Uh, you got the right tools. I got a little Phillips. And we're going to remove all the screws and save them. Make sure you are aware where to save them because you don't want to lose these. They're very difficult to replace. So let's go ahead and do that. And we're going to start with removing the cover first. And then we're going to actually open up and turn off the power. So let's go ahead and do that. Remove all the tools, all the actual screws, right? All right, we got them all. Now we're going to have to remove it from here, from the seam, all right? And it won't pop out, but... Do have a tool? You could use a credit card if you want, or something slim. And I have this, so so you won't scratch it. I always carry something here. Right in the corner, right here. That's probably the best spot. And then just just run it slowly. Um, and the Abra mic pops out after. So right through the corners. So we're gonna disconnect the battery. And in order to disconnect the battery, you gotta remove a couple of screws, right? So let's go ahead and do that. All right, the third screw is a hidden screw. It's in here, all right? Just make sure that you're aware that once you remove this, you can avoid things. But uh, one thing that Valve said that you could weaken the structure of the actual system. So, um, but you know what? We're gonna upgrade it. That's what we're doing. So let's go ahead and remove the last screw. There's the battery. We remove the battery just in case it turns on. That's the only thing. Now we're gonna replace the actual and then NVMe, all right? So let's go ahead and remove that. We're gonna use the same sleeve as that one, all right? So we're gonna remove that one. All right, so the actual NVMe is a little larger than the normal one. So if you guys notice, I kind of little ripped a little bit of aluminum, but I do have extra aluminum tape and I'm gonna go ahead and set it up right now and fix that. But today we're just gonna finish it out and plug it in and see how it works. So. Let's go ahead and set it up. Let's go ahead and set it up and finish it out. So we're going to plug in the battery back. All right. Plug it in the battery. Make sure you plug it in. I, I did tie it up already. Battery goes in. We use a plastic on this one. Push it back. There it goes. Push it forward. There it is. Locked in. Now we're going to cover it up. So we got the actual screws set up for our back, right? We cover it up. And let's go plug it everything back in. Once you verify that the whole Steam Deck is covered, go ahead and start the actual screw. So remember, we got four on the outside and four on the inside. The large ones on the outside. So that was it. Very simple, easy to install. I hope you guys enjoyed the video.